Holmes. And it's a goal! 2-1 Navy! Corner then for UK Armed Forces. And they've gone for the short corner this time. And the ball... That's in! It's in! Kira Boylan. Fantastic goal. Wow. That's what, I needed. That's what we've been waiting it's for. It's one excellent. Still the danger not cleared, and the RAF have it in the back of the net. Well, that was a really well taken goal by Lucy Farrow. All sorts of problems at the back for the Army defence there. They couldn't get the ball cleared. And it was Lucy Farrow who has opened the scoring here for the RAF. If Peel would have got himself on side there and made that little bit of extra effort, the army could have been in. That's looking for Bright, who hadn't made that extra effort. He's got Campbell in the penalty area. He's looked towards him. It's Michael Campbell. Oh, it's 3-2. And the RAF bench goes wild. He loves it in all the shot. Absolutely loves it. A hat trick two years ago. Well, he's at the double now. And the RAF have completed the turnaround, a performance, a comeback of champions. Leith Edwards looking to show us her game. Great tackle again from Nadina Green. Strong in there, that's a beautiful ball through. And this is the chance that barrow has been waiting for. Jade Barrow around the goalkeeper and gives the Navy the lead. Who else? Who else but Jade Barrow against the Army for the Navy? There was only going to be one goal scorer tonight. She's been waiting for 73 minutes for that opportunity. Trying to get some sort of foothold in this second half. It's been all the Dutch so far, but uh, you can with some promise here. And uh, here's Joe Spalding. Beats off one challenge. Plays it in field. It's a great shot and it's in the net! It's a goal for Yuka. And it's Danny Kerr who has got the goal. Well, he picked up the corner, the, the ball through. Superb work then from Joe Spalding. Danny Kerr spotted the opportunity and from around 25 yards out, he's hammered it into the back of the net and UCAF are back in the lead. O'Leary just couldn't contest against the spin of the Oh, Pip strong. Wilson from a massive distance has absolutely opened up this game. We did not see that coming, Carl. I mean, look, Pip Wilson, the quality she's got, that comes out of nowhere, yeah. The Navy, the Navy just sat on the floor there and said, what can you do about that? What a goal that is. The signal is here, they've come out really firing this is great work as well shot, shot comes up. in and oh, it's in what, what a, a goal finish that is, oh what a magnificent goal wow. and it's george cross well that was wow, sensational that was, that was a great finish i thought that was going wide to be honest but it nested in the top from our corner. angle it looked wide but he flew into the back of That's the net a great finish tried to grind out the game keep it nil nil and take an opportunity when it came the RAF might have an opportunity here with spaulding he's into the penalty area actually joe spaulding well, gives one -nil. the raf the lead Against the run of play, Joe Spalding against the Navy at Shrewsbury, again. The 
maybe do come away with it. And now Roche. Smart That's ball. That's a great ball. Can Walker get there? He can. The keeper kind of stuck in no man's land for a second. The ball Holmes from the back, back post. post. Holmes. And it's a goal! 2-1 Navy! Elliot Holmes with the moment. He's been the match winner against the army and tonight he may have done it again for the Royal Navy he loves the inter-service as you said earlier well the inter-services might just love him too the Navy are minutes away from being champions flipped it into the penalty area on the end of this is the big man and it's Jack has got in there Jack Wright a fantastic header from the free kick and UCAF are back level within just a couple of minutes of the Dutch taking the lead. Looking for a fourth goal. Which would surely put the game beyond the Dutch but uh, in the, the way this is going who knows really nice work again Kerr on the edge of the penalty area he goes for another shot and he gets another goal well that was brilliant from Danny Kerr once again on the edge of the penalty area he has struck it's a fourth goal for UCAF Danny Kerr is on the verge of a hat-trick now, so to Dawa on the right hand right side. Hand side. Dawa cross that in. That, that's not a very good cross. Really Back to Vivek. It's a great Vivek shot. What it's a goal! Oh what my God! What a goal! Oh my God! And that was Vivek Garung. That was Vivek Garung. Vivek Garung has oh got the goal. God. Vivek that Garung. A shot on the edge. Well, he must have been 25 yards oh out. Oh my At God! Least. Vivek Garung. What and a volley that was. Better there, but Farrow's in here. And it's Dixon. What's happened to the Dutch defence? Dixon shot is blocked on the left foot, maybe blocked again. Great opportunity for UK. It's Farrow. It's still not done, and I think they are now. Very not... unselfish from Farrow there to lay it off to Libby Dixon. Captain looking to challenge away from it, but still full for Wilson. The Dutch have just had a wobble here. Wilson shot from range. Oh, oh what a goal! In. What a goal! We mentioned that Pitt Wilson can do something from nothing. Yeah. 30 seconds of madness from the Dutch and the UCAF take the lead. We just heard of him very frustrated and then she goes and uh, scores an absolute worldie. Great goal by Pitt Wilson. They've just got, what, just over five minutes to play. There'll yeah. be a little bit of extra time added, obviously, for the substitutions. It's been a terrific game of football, really worthy of the name of the cup final here. The, the oh, league. great play from... And it's a chance Jamie for Turner again, goal. and he's gone for and the chip. Oh, and he has scored. Wow. Well, this is magnificent stuff. It's That's Luke Greenway wow. who, this time, he's got the goal. What? That was a joker finish. His, wow. his second goal of the match. He just lobbed it over the goalkeeper. There's so much space. It's 5 2.